Hello friends, welcome to Right Clicks with Saravana. This week, I am going to talk on a topic that's know your worth. Let me start with a small story. You know, in this story, a father is in his uh, deathbed and he has called his only son. He was having regrets that he can't, he could not really give much property to his son and all. And his son was also very unhappy that his father could not really give him uh, any property, you know, worth saying. Uh, but anyway, so his father, he really wanted to give him something. So he just took out his uh, watch and uh, gave, gave that to him. And he requested his son, go out and, uh, you know, uh, find the worth of it. So he straight away, the son straight away went to a watch shop and, uh, you know, he, he asked for the worth of that watch and uh, he was told only 1000 rupees, right? So he came back and he was already upset uh, that his father could not give him any anything worth of it. Uh, now his father had given him a watch and that is costing, that is worth of only 1000 rupees. So he said the same thing to his father. His father requested him to go again, maybe to a jewelry shop and find out its worth. So he went to a jewelry shop and in the jewelry shop he was offered just 2000 rupees, right? So he came back again and said this to the father, uh, his father. So he said, please go to a nearby museum and ask for the worth of this watch. So he went to a museum and in the museum his watch was examined uh, by the people there. And then after 10 minutes, the curator of that museum told him that we will be very happy to take this watch because it's one of the antique collection. So he was very keenly asking how much you will give. He said, we are ready to give you 30 lakh rupees. You know, he was so much shocked. He just came running back to his father saying like, I don't know why, but in museum they are offering me 30 lakh rupees. So his father said, this is exactly my son I wanted to teach you before I die. Know your worth. Every thing has got its own value. Every individual has got value. The only thing is we need to find the right place where that particular value is appreciated and, and you know, acknowledged. So that exactly is what you should look for. If you end up in a wrong place and where your worth value is not really recognized, then there is no point in cribbing and crying there. Get out of that place, try to find a right place where your values are, where your right value or the worth is really recognized. Small example is, um, you know, uh, a water droplet. There are two options. Water droplet can become part of a big ocean, right? So then that particular water droplet has got no separate value, right? But if the same water droplet falls on a leaf, it shines, its value becomes so obvious and it gets reflected, right? That exactly is the right place wherever worth is valued. That exactly is the place one should try to be there, right? Friends, this is also about... Uh, the self-worth, self-worth, self-worth is all about self-esteem and self-esteem is knowing, you know, what you are getting now, but what you exactly deserve to get. So that exactly is self-esteem. So the effort should always be to try to find out whether our, you know, worth is valued in a place or not, because we cannot think of being acceptable to others unless you know we have proven acceptable to ourselves right so that is the knowing the difference between what you are actually getting and what you deserve to get is is knowing your worth and never ever settle for anything less than you deserve right so now friends um, once uh, you know if you know your worth then you will know you are worthy of a beautiful and higher life so that's the takeaway from this video. I hope you enjoyed this video, dear friends. And 2021 New Year has just started. My hearty wishes for you all to have a 
happy, healthy and prosperous new year. Thank you. Till I see you next week. Bye-bye.